Hello everybody and welcome back to Mass Effect 2 Legendary Edition where it has been a while and I apologize for that. Um, I have been somewhat self-conscious doing the recording stuff. Uh, I still am, however I do have some soundproofing that I finally got a hold of up on the connecting door. So hopefully, as far as I know, the wall that's not connecting to somebody so the problem, okay, so the hotel rooms are set up so that they have like connecting doors, right? And those are the ones that usually you can hear sound through. I can't usually hear sound through the walls. Like I don't usually hear them from the other side is what I'm trying to say. So hopefully me talking normally, at least fairly normally, won't get anybody mad at me. But you know what? We're just gonna, sorry. Uh, we're just gonna have to hope for the best because I am also tired of talking like super quietly. Uh, I still am kind of talking quietly, but it's actually really kind of painful after a while and it's also it takes a lot of breath control and it's uh it's not as fun <laughs> um but really quick i'm gonna go make sure my fish are alive but yes i do apologize for taking so long um to get mass effect back up because i was recording i recorded a bunch of horizons uh forbidden west and then i recorded a bunch of the Frozen Wilds DLC from Horizon Zero Dawn. Hang on, I'm moving this again. Um, and so, I don't know, at some point, like, I felt like I was recording so much and I was getting really self-conscious of, like, if people could hear me. <laughs> uh, oh, what the freak? What the, the hey, hey, don't do that. Uh, I just noticed, however, in our quests that I haven't <laughs> there's one quest I haven't finished down here. You guys good? You're the best, Commander. We just got those FBA couplings installed. Now we only have to calibrate every week instead of every day. We're thinking about celebrating our newfound free time with some Skillion 5 poker. Want to join us? Why are we having issues here? Wanna play cards with grease monkeys like us? Well, free no, man, come on. Actually, that sounds interesting. You in, Tally? <gasps> sure, that sounds fun. Fantastic. I'll get the cards. Oh, okay, okay. Here's the thing. I'm glad I forgot because I have never actually had Tally play with me before. Usually I get this, like, this is one of the first quests you get, and I usually complete it really quickly. And Tally is, like, in the second wave of dossiers. So, oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, that's so fun. I learn new things every time. My Skillion 5's a bit rusty. It'll be easy on the rookie, right? Of course, Commander. It's all friendly. Yeah, right. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> be gentle on the rookie. I can't believe we fell for that. Never underestimate Shepard. It's so worth losing to see you taken down a notch. Beat me up my own game. You're all right, Shepard. <laughs> Let's see, I think we talked we talked with Tally and everything. Shepard, what can I do for you? Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? I'll you know, you nobody work. ever makes fun talk of to you later. Nobody makes fun of Tally for her. Oh, I gotta clean the engine, but it's the Garrus one. I gotta do some calibrations that sets everybody to laughing with frustration. Oh, I did decide. No, 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 no. Ah, I can't. Mm, do I want? Okay, I need. I know I looked this up before, but I need to double check again. I need to double check and see if this is gonna like lock me into something, which isn't necessarily bad. It might actually. Yep. Yep. Mm -hmm. I was gonna say this might actually it might force me to do it and it it will so it's okay we have all our friends um, I was gonna say we were gonna do grunts mission um, but off we go to do some terrible things <laughs> this mission sucks And I'm playing on hard, right? Oh my gosh, this is gonna, this is, just, oh my gosh. Wait, am I playing on insanity on this? No, I'm playing on hard. Shepard, we got a break. No. I intercepted a distress call from a Torian patrol. They stumbled onto oh, the no. collector ship beyond the coral system. No. The Torians were wiped out, but not before they crippled the collector vessel. I need you to board that ship and get some hard data on the collectors. 
find us a way to get to their home world. How, how did they, yeah, I was like, I know he answers it, but it's still frustrating. It's like, excuse me, my state-of-the-art ship, the Normandy couldn't disable it, and this Turian frigate could? Hard to imagine how a Turian patrol could take out a collector's ship. Reports indicate the hull's intact, but all systems seem to be offline. They could be making repairs as we speak. I'm not saying it won't be dangerous, but we can't let an opportunity like this slip by. It's a trap. If they had a patrol out there, why aren't the Turians sending a recon team in? They will, eventually. But I intercepted the transmissions. In the meantime, we're feeding them false reports. My goodness gracious. You're close enough that you can be in and out before the Turians learn the truth. You sure this information's good? Information is my weapon, Shepard. It's good. Send me the coordinates and I'll take care of it. Already sent. Once you're aboard the ship, establish an uplink with Edie. She'll mine their data for information regarding the Omega-4 relay. Good luck, Shepard. Coordinates punched in. Let's go Bye, find Dad. the collector ship. I actually can't call him that. Anderson Shepard's dad. He's like my evil stepfather. Not evil. <laughs> uh, morally gray stepfather. How many... Okay, that's right. Um, okay, are these... These are the only two we've done the loyalty missions for. That's why they're... Got the circles. Okay, okay. Collector's ship. I think they'll have a lot of armor. Biotics is good against armor. I don't think they're gonna be tech heavy. Usually, too, honestly, Grunt is a really good one to bring on anything because he technically has the highest health pool. And as we get further in the game, we get closer and closer to like the suicide mission at the end. I am gonna try to find that graphic, the infographic that explains the suicide mission in detail and like the, the, the pass fail conditions. And I'm gonna put it in the video because it's really intense. It's there's a lot that goes on in there. I could bring Jim. See, the thing is, is I'm like I really like the Thane Samara setup, but for the end game, well, no. Usually I bring Grunt with me on the end game, but that actually did bite me in the butt once, and I lost Morden. Um, let's let's do it. Let's just... Mm-hmm. Well, I could save it up, but it would only give me three, so maybe I will just give her a pull. Warp. I don't have warp. So you can have warp. What? I have my missile launcher, excellent. Although, to be fair, fighting the these guys, the collector particle beam is actually pretty good. I'll use the collector particle beam. I don't think there's anything like ships that we need to worry about. It's all basically hand-to-hand -hand combat. Yeah, I feel like I don't have as many guns as I usually do by now. I know we're not super far through the game. We have a visual on the collector ship, Commander. Very low emissions. Passive infrared temperatures suggest most systems are offline. Thrusters are cold. That thing is massive. How the hell did the Turians take it out? It's a trap! <laughs> uh, spoilers, but we all know. <laughs> scans do not detect any hull breaches on the side facing us. I detect no mass effect field distortions. It appears the drive core is offline. Rendezvous in 30 seconds, Commander. Good luck. That looks like a bug attached to my back. I think there was a Doctor Who episode about that, actually. It was like the one that like would change like change your the course of your path, like, like your life path with just like simple decisions and then feed off the energy. It was with Donna, who was my favorite Doctor Who companion. I watched Christopher Ecclestein, David Tennant, and most of Matt Smith. I don't think I finished the last season. Anyway, that's my Doctor Who tangent. As we're gonna go into spooky 
I don't know, it seems like a living ship kind of a thing. I don't remember if the collector ships are actually alive or not. Look at Thane, he's so intimidating. I've never seen a ship like this before. Mm -hmm. Looks like an insect hive. Penetrating scans right. detected an access node to uplink with collector data banks. Marking location to your heart suit computer. Oh, this thing is so creepy. Let me check. Oh, graphics, what is that? Gameplay. I'm playing a veteran. And then I think, yeah, then it's hard. Oh, okay. I, 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 I went easy on myself, apparently. Okay. I think I started out playing on hard. And Oh, that's right, I did. I remember. Okay, I'm sorry. It's been a while. Oh, it's a trap! Maybe the defense tower softened it for the Turians. Perhaps the missing colonists are aboard. If they're still alive. Dun, dun, dun! Uh, but yes, I remember because I encountered the armored husks and immediately <laughs> was like, nope. The collectors used these on Horizon. However, these are empty. It must have been horrible. Trapped in these pods. Completely at the mercy of the collectors. Yeah, cool, thanks. No, for reals. Oh. These poor souls. Mm. What? Why are these here? Perhaps they were used for testing. If they were a control group, they would have been discarded at the end of the experiment. They didn't deserve this. Too few in life ever get what they deserve. That's... Yep, I'm pretty sure every time, well, no matter what you say, somebody's got something like that, right? Where they say that and it's like, oh, like, you know, it's just a punch. Punch in the gut. Look at these video games. Giving me morals. Making me deal with terrible situations and realizing the morality of everything. Oh, but you get some money. How nice. Also, you can- I can hear them. Oh, yeah, this is where we get a big- a big reveal. That's a collector. Were they experimenting on one of their own? Edie, I'm uploading the data from this terminal. See if you can figure out what they were up to. Data received. The collectors were running baseline genetic comparisons between their species and humanity. Are they looking for similarities? I have no hypothesis on their motivations. All I have are the preliminary results. They reveal something remarkable. A quad strand genetic structure identical to traces collected from ancient ruins. Only one race is known to have this structure. Dun dun dun! Working for the Reapers now. These are no longer Prothean Shepherd. Their genes show distinct signs of extensive genetic rewrite. The Reapers have repurposed them to suit their needs. So, for those who may not remember, the Protheans are the people, the, the ancient alien species that existed about 50,000 years ago that has given us, at least according to what we know currently, uh, most of our technologies. So anytime a an advanced enough civilization discovers uh, it's like ancient like alien ruins, it was the Prothean ruins, and they would get like the Mass Effect technologies and stuff from that. So, but there's more yet to come, as we know. Um, the Protheans were also manipulated to find kind of spoilers, I guess. But like the Protheans were also manipulated for. Because a lot of this, their technology came that they found came before them, and it's just this like vicious cycle of everybody discovering air quotes this ancient technology and evolving along like preset like paths, right? And it's like, oh my gosh! You'd think somebody would have picked up on this. No one has had an opportunity to study a collector genetic code in this detail. I've already matched two thousand alleles to recorded fragments. This collector likely descends. What? 
Holy cow. There are signs of extreme alteration. Three fewer chromosomes. Reduced heterochromatin structure. Elimination of superfluous junk sequences. Reapers didn't wipe out the Protheans. They turned them into monsters and enslaved them. Still, they're working for the Reapers now, and we have to stop them. No species should have to suffer through that. Let's find what we need before the collectors come that to this vessel. That arm, that shrug. Oh my gosh, you see that all the time. She does it all the time. Assault rifle. Oh, oh, that's right. I get advanced weapon weapons training. I want... Yes, this is what I usually get. I usually get the Krogan shotgun when I'm playing Vanguard. Um, but I think when you're, when you're playing Vanguard, you get the option to have the sniper rifle, the shotgun, or the rifle training. Um, because you can already use the SMG and the pistol, and you can already use the shotgun, but this gives you the Krogan shotgun. Mm -hmm -hmm. I can't believe- I think somebody pointed this out in a comment, but like, it's a human design, but only used by Krogan, because we made it so powerful, it literally breaks a human's arm. Like, that's very human of us to make a, a weapon that not even we can use, only the Krogan scan. I should probably get assault rifle training, but I'm a sucker for shotguns, so. Do I have it equipped? Yes. Especially now that my my little dash thing is... We don't have anybody else here with shotguns. See, this is part of the problem, is these guys' weapons are not probably... I probably should have brought somebody who could use an assault rifle. But I brought a sniper. Wait. <gasps> she can use an assault rifle? Oh my goodness. But I... Oh, she only has... She has the... I don't know if I like that one. I'm pretty sure I don't like... I don't like the Matic, right? Semi-automatic? Mm. Yeah, I think I like the Vindicator, not the Matic. Okay. It is kind of funny to think of Samara with a... With a especially because she's technically full biotic, I think? And she has an assault rifle? It's kind of funny, but... Ooh. Ooh. They're so... These <laughs> Oh, they're already... Oh, good. They're all goo. Now. Or dead. I brought two very um, somewhat ominous people <laughs> with me, I'm not gonna lie. <laughs> Their pronouncements, anyway, are very uh, true, but uh, ominous regardless. I think I was saying earlier, I'm excited for this shotgun because... Now that my dash goes a lot faster, I'm gonna use the shotgun more, hopefully. This looks interesting. Yeah, well, some some things have power and some things don't. <laughs> Dogging me for two years? Yeah. Way beyond coincidence. Something doesn't add up, Commander. Watch your back. To be fair, um, there's probably not that many collector ships floating around out here. Like we, I think we would have noticed them by now. I know that they tend to keep to the shadows, but if there was a whole fleet of them, I think we would have noticed. I say that, but who freaking knows? <laughs> Space is a big place. I couldn't do it. <laughs> the terminus systems and not have enough to fill these pods. They're going to target Earth. Um, not if we stop. I'm them. trying to be like slow, like doing the slow pan, and it didn't work. <laughs> anyway, yeah, there's so many, so many. It's it's a lot. It's a lot. Look how shiny it is, though. There, on the 
platform, a control panel. Where are the bodies of the collector crew? Careful, Shepard. Something doesn't feel right. That's about a really this. good point. I knew it was a trap, but I forget that we don't see. You know, there's there's no dead collector bodies except for that one. Hey, wow, this will be fine. Edie, I'm setting up a bridge between you and the collector ship. See if you can get anything useful from the data banks. It's a virus. Data mine in progress, Shepard. Ow. Uh, that can't be good. Ow. <laughs> Ew, no. Everyone's all right, Joker. What just happened? Major power surge. Everything went dark, but we're back out now. I managed to divert the majority of the overload to non-critical systems. Shepard, it was not a malfunction. This was a trap. Oh, there they are. That little coinkadink. We need a little help here, Edie. I'm having trouble maintaining connection. There's someone else in the system. <laughs> of all people, Samara would not be the one on the ground, guaranteed. <laughs> Okay, hang on. This is not. Better get it done fast, Edie. No, not the, no, no, not the scion. No. Okay, 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 okay. We're good. I'm gonna put my um, no. For now, we'll do the pistol, and then we'll do the shotgun when I start running up into people. There. I forget though that I can't aim, so that's cool. They have barriers. Oh no. Let's hope for the best, let's hope for the best. Wow, cool, that sucks so much. I didn't go didn't go through the barrier. Mm -hmm. I thought I was gonna go through the barrier and I didn't. That's cool, it's cool, it's fine. Yep, I'm, I'm just absolutely not gonna make it. Come on, oh my gosh, please. Yep. Oh, that was uh, not my best. Not my best. Also, I still can't aim. I don't know why. Do they have... Oops. What are they I'm just gonna run it. I'm just gonna I'm just gonna go. Actually what I'm gonna do Contact. first is this. Not you. Why? Holy cow, what the She's dying so fast. Let this person I tried. I couldn't move. I was stuck. Okay, he punched me to death. It's fine. I'll just punch him to death next time.
Oh my gosh, I had to switch to freaking mouse and keyboard. I couldn't freaking see any. I couldn't. I couldn't hit Shepherd, anything. You must manually reestablish my link to the command console. Ah, uh, but I don't know how. To, okay. And I also I keep pressing space as like a pause to like try to like access my abilities, and that's not shift. And I'm like, oh jeez. I've regained control of the platform, Shepard. Oh, good. You wouldn't let us down, Edie. I always work at optimal capacity. Did you get what we needed? I found data that would help us successfully navigate the Omega-4 relay. I have also found a Turian distress call that served as the lure for this trap. The collector's rich source. It is unusual. It seems logical to me that they would have sent the initial message as bait. No, it is unusual because Turian emergency channels have secondary encryption. It is corrupted in the message. It is not possible that the elusive man would believe the distress call was genuine. Why are you so sure? I found the anomaly with Cerberus detection protocols. He wrote them. He knew it was a trap? Why would he send us into a trap? Mm. I don't want to be angry. My shepherd isn't angry, so I'm going to do this. But I do think it's going to be like, mm, he sent us into a trap. We don't have time to throw blame around. We'll question him when we're out. Cerberus does have a long history of betrayal. Uh, Commander, we got another problem. The collector ship is powering up. You need to get out of there before their weapons come online. I'm not losing another Normandy. I do not have full control of their systems. I will do what I can. Sending coordinates for shuttle extraction. Come on, let's move. Okay, well, now that we're back to fighting, I will... Hang on. Okay, shift. And that's how I change my weapons out. We'll go in with a pistol. Just because... For long, anything long distance, but... Undo that. I'm going. Nope. I don't know how to undo that. Nope. Getting out of fire. Hopefully they come with me. I don't know. Or I'll just have to boss them around. I <laughs> see. I, I keep pressing E to interact with things. Shift. You cannot hurt me. Oh, contraire. The forces of the universe bend to me. Oh. I know you feel this. Releasing control. Releasing control. Yeah, okay, that's how you're gonna say it. Oh, I have horrible flashbacks. I have flashbacks of every place, but this one... I think actually the next mission is probably the worst. On like the hardcore difficulty. Uh, okay, never mind. And not you either. Oh my gosh, I'm trying to like learn a new system as I go. Mm, nope, I am not trying to do that. Mm, nope, I don't want to do that. <laughs> I also can't turn in this mode, which is annoying. What is? I don't know what melee is in this uh, version of me. Let's check. <laughs> it's probably M. You think? No, it can't be M.
F. That makes more sense. Okay. How many? Okay. Wait. Oh. Oh my. See, I keep doing. I keep pressing the wrong. I do it again, doing it again. Oh, I'm doing it. Oh no, not these guys. Oh no, I'm doing it again. Oh my gosh, please. I can. No, we're not. Oh my gosh, I can't do it. Haha, I have the high ground now. Oh no, 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 no. Whew, okay. I'm figuring it out <laughs> on the fly. Oh my gosh. Oops. Understood. Oh, um, I, mm, I should probably call this one here. Oopsie daisy. Haha. -ha. Uh, we're going to call it here. Hopefully it's not too long, or hopefully I don't have to, like, do a weird combination of episodes. But thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. Uh, it's really, it's really ramping up in excitement. Welcome back. <laughs> um, but really quick, I want to say thank you to my patrons, to all my patrons, but to especially my sapling tier patron, Reese Galito. Thank you so much for your support. And an extra special thank you to Christopher, my tree tier patron. Thank you so much for your support. I really, really appreciate it. Thank you all again for watching, and I hope to see you in the next one.